inflation and its effects on production. We have already discussed about the inflation and its causes. Now let us take a look at the effects of inflation. There are three major areas which are affected by inflation. They are first effects on production, second effects on distribution and third non-economic effects. Let us understand effects of inflation on production in much more detail. Effects on production Inflation produces a very deep impact on the production of wealth in an economy. Mild inflation stimulates production, employment and income. In case the economy is in a state before it achieves full employment level. Such stimulation gives a right to economy towards full employment level. Once the economy is in full employment level, any further increase in money supply creates a situation of hyperinflation. Consequently, it also disrupts the smooth functioning of the economy. It has few adverse effects on the production. Let us go through them one at a time. Decrease in value of money. Depreciation in the value of money results into more spending for the same quantum of goods or services. Thus, less money would now be available in the hands of the people, which in turn discourages public savings. Consequently, capital accumulation suffers which ultimately affects the production in an economy. Decrease in foreign investments. Foreign investors invest funds to mainly earn profits. They generally prefer stable economies to safeguard their investments. Thus, a situation of inflation in an economy may finally lead to foreign investors shying away from parking their funds in a country. This in turn leads to decrease in production levels. Decrease in domestic investments. As previously seen, inflation takes a toll on the savings of people in an economy. This invariably reduces the capital accumulation, finally resulting in reduced investments from the domestic front. Business uncertainty. Business uncertainties may arise due to several conditions. For example, Unexpected rise in costs, increasing competition from other companies, change in policy by the government, or suppliers going bust. Capital accumulation declines on account of business uncertainty. It discourages entrepreneurs and businessmen from taking business risks in production. Diversion of productive resources. It is but natural that a businessman will find those investments lucrative, which generates higher revenue. Inflation thus results in the diversion of productive resources from essential goods industries to luxury goods industries as consumption of luxury items is more immune to price changes. Deterioration in the quality of goods. Excess demand creates the need for a higher production. When prices of components that contribute in production rise, businessmen find cheaper alternatives. They also neglect the quality of components while selecting alternative as it is a case of seller's market. Thus, the quality of goods may deteriorate. 
hoarding of essential goods. Traders and consumers stock excessive quantity of the essential goods in anticipation of potential rise in prices. Traders hoard goods to reap higher profits in future. Consumers hoard goods out of a fear of spending more for the same goods in future. Loss of confidence. If domestic currency is facing hyperinflation, it offers comparatively less purchasing power to the people than other stable foreign currencies. On the other hand, frequent changes in value of money is considered to be a risk to business. Therefore, investors lose confidence in their home currency and start investing in a stable foreign currency. To summarize, the effects of inflation on production are First, decrease in value of money. Second, decrease in foreign investments. Third, decrease in domestic investments. Fourth, business uncertainties. Fifth, diversion of productive resources. Sixth, hoarding of essential goods. And seventh, loss of confidence.